Hello, welcome or welcome back. In today's video, I'll be swatching 20 solid gel polishes I got from Shein. This is a full extension on what I briefly spoke about in my Shein unboxing video. If you haven't seen that, go and check that out after this. I want to apologise firstly for my stuffy voice. Um, I'm coming down with a cold, so unfortunately I'm just going to have to deal with it. But I do want to keep on posting and just up in my content game so you know as they say the show must go on so while this is playing out i just want to talk about my process so when i saw the listing on Shein, i was really excited because i was in a predicament whether to get a normal gel polishes or solid ones from betsy but i couldn't justify spending more money on their website because at this point i had already made three purchases that week which was more than i was anticipating anyways scrolling through i noticed that they had singles and a 20 pack the 20 pack only had two left in stock so i grabbed it quickly and put it in my cart and a week later here we are so right off the bat i noticed that they look very similar to the betsy polishes but I'll get into that a bit later when I do the comparison. This set was £20. I have points and vouchers, so they only ended up being about £15, which, in my opinion, is very, very good because the quality of them are near perfect from the consistency to the colour. I was not disappointed. However, they're slightly a bit stringy, but it's minor, so we move. The next is the colours. Um, the colours in this set are very vibrant, which I like. I think, sorry, voice is like going, but I can definitely mix and match them to get just the perfect shade that I want. I could even blend a base coat to get more of a jelly consistency. Like the possibilities are like endless, to be fair. I'm yet to use them on myself but I do have another video in the works testing them out with poly gel so stay tuned by subscribing and turning on the notifications. I would say if you're in the market for some solid gel polishes definitely pick up this set. For myself as a beginner I wish I'd come to Shein first because lately they've been stepping up their game and I mean seriously stepping up their game. I've tried many of their new products from rings and other stuff as well but we're just gonna stick to nail art and polishes in this video. So as this portion of the video is wrapping up, I'm gonna keep quiet, I'm gonna relax my voice before it goes and disappears and probably won't come back for a while. So I'll be back for the comparison. Now that that's all swatched, let's get into the comparison. Here I have three solid gel polishes from Vetsy. Number 4, Alphabet. Number 86, Crush. And number 14, Night Dream. I'll be comparing Night Dream from Vetsy to number 19 on Shein. Well, from Shein. As you can see, they look almost identical. I had to slow down a bit and really pay attention because my brain wanted to put the Vetsy lid on the Shein base. And honestly, if it's not for the logos, you could hardly tell the difference side by side. The consistency of both are the same, I think. The Shein tub looks slightly bigger. However, they're both listed as 5 grams. On the Vetsy website, you can get a 12 pack for £33. For £33, which honestly, as a beginner, I want something affordable and can experiment with. And this 20 pack from Shein for only £15 is the better deal, in my opinion. But both are very good quality, so whichever one you go for, whichever ones like you like the look of, then definitely go with your choice. But in my opinion, I would go with the Shein one. I have the Vetsy one already, so I can say I like both, but I'm tending now to go towards the Shein one. So overall, this Shein product is really good, and I would recommend you pick it up if you are starting your nails at home. I will leave the links in the description. 
this concludes my review of the 20 pack solid gel polish from Shein. In my next video I'll be unboxing something new and exciting so be the first to watch it by subscribing down below and turning on the notifications. I'll catch up with you again in the next one. Bye!